No one ever said parenting is easy. On one hand, we want to give our kids room to grow and be independent, but when it comes to traffic safety, we have to supervise them. So, when it comes to educating our kids about traffic safety, what do they need to know? Here's Holly with the answer. I'm here with my friend and fellow mom, Rosie, and we're going to go over the general rules when it comes to kids and traffic today. Right, there are a lot of things to learn about how to be safe around traffic, yeah. and kids need lots of practice and feedback from us. It's never too early to start, no. but only you can know when your child is ready to cross the street on their own. Streets are not the only hazardous place for kids. There's also parking lots and driveways and sidewalks, and they need to know how to negotiate those areas as well. Drivers often can't see children because of their size. Cars are big and kids are small. And another thing to consider is that drivers aren't always looking out for your kids. They often overestimate the skills and knowledge that kids have as pedestrians. Kids need to learn about how to be safe around traffic. They need a lot of practice and we need to teach them. And as parents, we are the best role models. So the first step is to teach your kids how to cross safely and you take them through step by step. Let's push the button so we can get the walk sign. Good job. Okay, take hands. Okay, then we're going to stop at the curb and we're going to look for traffic. First, we're going to go left. Good job. Okay, right. Look for cars. And then left again. Okay. The crosswalk says it's safe to cross and, and no cars are coming, so we're going to go ahead and cross, but we're going to stay in the crosswalk, and while we're doing that, we're going to still listen for traffic. Whether you're in parking lots or on sidewalks or crossing the street, always make sure your child is supervised by you or another adult, and keep your attention on them. Make sure you're always looking for possible hazards, like cars backing up in parking lots, cars moving in and out of driveways, and cars turning in intersections. Right. Always hold your child's hand and keep them close to you. Quinn here is six years old and he'd really like to cross the street by himself. How do I know when he's ready? Well, it's really up to parents. You need to observe their behavior, know their level of responsibility, and make sure they know the safety rules, um, and if they use good judgment. Safe Kids USA suggests that around 10 years or older, they may be ready to cross the street on their own. So keeping kids safe around traffic is really up to us. Exactly. And here's some key points to remember. Number one, teach and practice the safety rules. Number two, hold your child's hand when crossing the street. And number three, supervise your child when near traffic. Being a safe pedestrian is an important life skill to teach our kids. And teaching them the safety rules is the best thing you can do. 